Hey guys, welcome back to The Game Replay. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Final Fantasy X-2 HD Remaster for the Sony PlayStation 3. Yuna's shopping. She's shopping. <laughs> I thought I'd start her off uh, on the side again. It's not that hard to spot her in this scene, I would like to think, but usually you'd think I'd start her just like right here in the middle of the room on the, on the nice bright yellow carpet. No, man, I'm pulling a fastball. I'm getting sneaky lately. Oh, man. What am I gonna do next? Uh, this is ridiculous. Okay, so uh, how's everyone doing here? We see fiends around here all the time, but that thing was huge. How are you supposed to take down a monster like that? They're saying a gigantic fiend is on the loose. How big do you suppose it is? If it's hiding out in a cave underground, it can't be that big, can it? Just when the fun was about to get started, this fiend came bursting out of the ground. It apparently headed south toward Guado Salam. What if it, like, entered Guado Salam? That'd be crazy. Would it? What if it just burst through? Yeah. Why don't the fiends ever attack the villages? Well, mm. Sin attacked villages back in back in the old day of a couple years ago. We had a, a fiend fight, Sin spawn fight, uh, right outside of Kilika. Remember? Uh, 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 yeah. What else? Yeah. Oh my, hello everybody, man. I am going to this cave, we're gonna fight fiends. Before I get there, there's gonna be a jillion random battles because uh... How is everyone doing today? I am on a mission, a mission to record. Sometimes you gotta, you gotta, you gotta produce, man. You gotta put out the vids. Or at least record the vids. And then you can put them out. Unfortunately, I have to walk back down over here. So, uh, let's see here. The agenda today. I'm going to this cave. I'm gonna fight a fiend. We're gonna put on a concert. It's probably gonna be very flashy and special. Okay, this is a square game. I'm sure there's gonna be a big old light show. And it's gonna be so very dramatic. And then after that, we're gonna do some reflecting, right? We're gonna reflect and then think. And then after we think, we'll have an awkward scene or two, and then a serious scene, and then we're gonna get to business. There is a big fiend inside. Are you sure you're ready to go in? Uh, did you, uh, refreshify me? Thanks, bra. I'll kill you last. Actually, no, I'll kill you first then. That's the, that's the mercy kind of, yeah, okay. So yeah, I'm gonna kill him first. Genocide, genocide. I am going to exterminate every single one of the uh, high pillow. Oh no, I don't remember this at all. Where do I go? I'm working on my third cup of coffee today, folks. I'm just telling you now. Relax, it's, it's a light roast. It's a light roast coffee. My third light roast coffee. This is no, no, this is not medium roast. Don't be absurd. Listen, lizard guy, don't jump on me. Don't do that. I'm not, uh, not down with that. Oh, no. Where are we? Where are we going in here? Is it just me? It's like an optical illusion, but the chest almost looks like it's slightly hovering above the ground. You know what I'm talking about there? Or is it the coffee? <laughs> no, no, it's not the first time that you kind of like see the chest like in that sort of way, that fashion. I mean, I don't really, I don't know how to explain it. I don't know the deal with it, but yeah, something about how the chest just doesn't look natural on the ground. It's a natural thing. Yeah, that's it. That's a good 
Next time, I, I don't care what the argument is and who you're having an argument with or whatever you're discussing, but turn to that person after it's pretty much all done and say, it's a natural thing. It's a natural thing. It's because it's a natural thing, that's why. You wanna know why I did that? Because it's a natural thing. It's a natural thing. Say it any way you have to. But just make sure to inform the people you're talking to that it is a natural thing. I don't know what I'm talking about right now. This is, uh... This is filler. This is what I do, folks. This is called filler. Okay, I'm walking around the boring cave here. What, what do you want me to talk about? Battle strategies? <laughs> no, I don't do that. I, uh, I talk about, <laughs> I talk about uh, the natural stuff and stuff that makes no sense. Seems more useful to me anyway. All right, you want battle strategy? Okay, so I'm gonna fight the big dragon thing in the cave, all right? And it's gonna be a battle, and he's gonna attack me, and that's gonna go, and that's gonna do damage. Oh no, damage! So, okay, what what do we do? Oh, I'm gonna damage him. There you go, good stuff. But then he might damage me too greatly. Oh, I'm gonna heal myself as well. Oh no, the game's not that basic though. I guess I. Oh no, you don't want to get down there. I don't know where that goes. The game's not that basic. Final Fantasy X-2 actually has a pretty nice uh, battle battle setup. A lot of people say it's superior to Final Fantasy X's. Because in Final Fantasy X, uh, you know, every character, every person has, like, their thing. You know, Lulu's the Black Mage, Yuna, White Mage Summoner. Well, Pain? Who? What was... Okay, I don't know who was talking there. I don't want to go down there. Ugh. But yeah, like Yuna, Summoner, White Mage, uh, Orin, Heavy Hitter, Kamari, oh, Kamari was like a free agent. Riku, the, uh, what do you call Riku? I don't even know. The one who does the rest. Yeah, she did the rest. She did every, she did all the little things, everything else. That was Riku's job in 10. But now 10-2, you know, we can switch in and out of uh, dress spheres and, I don't know. It's a little more fast paced, definitely more fast. They have to change it up. This game is basically a 180 in every way. Battle setup wise, story wise, uh, what else? I don't know. It's like chocolate ice cream and then vanilla ice cream. Final Fantasy X being chocolate ice cream, and this game, Final Fantasy X 2, being vanilla. Not everyone likes chocolate, not everyone likes vanilla. But at least there's something for all. How do you guys like my filler? Riku! Run, you fool! Run! If I could just get to the dragon part, too, you know, that'd be cool. Uh, uh, there he is. Kinda silly how he's just kinda like laying there. I feel bad, I feel like I shouldn't be doing this, you know? I was just chilling, having a, whoa, whoa, what's, did I interrupt something? Was this, did I just witness crossbreeding here between the uh, jello mold and uh, a and, uh, smaller dragon? The smaller dragon guy here? I could have sworn someone was getting mounted. Was someone getting mounted? Maybe I should title the video this. Mounted. Now, we'll have to combine a couple things here. Ah. Uh. Ah, I see. Party's over, huh, you two? Don't let him take advantage. Jello mold. No, we can't title it something silly. This isn't a silly part. This is gonna be a very epic part, and well, depending on how the, the video goes. But uh, yeah, a lot of uh, story elements and plot points gonna be coming together here soon. 
Let's, uh, let's kill this guy and eat him. Isn't this cute? Okie dokie. I'm gonna kick this thing's ass. Uh, alright. Hmm. No powerful. Game, no game. He's powerful. This had better be worth it. Yuna, how you doing? Um Go Alchemist, Yuna. Oh no, it's gonna kill pain. Oh, wait. Wait. Okay. Ah. Uh, bad time for a high potion on pain then. Uh, okay, I'm just getting my getting myself situated. I forgot to heal myself before the battle. I was too busy about thinking about what it would be like to, to eat a dragon, you know? How dragon would taste? Probably just like a big iguana. You can eat iguanas. I have yet to eat iguana, but I'd like to get on that. Not as crazy as... Not as... <sighs> Thanks, Yuna. Not as crazy as you might think. So now we have an alchemist. I can do some healing with Yuna. Hmm. Darkness spell. Oh, for God's sakes. Okay, but we're gonna be okay now because Yuna can be uh, doing that stuff. No pain, no gain. Doesn't take too long for her to do stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna use Phoenix Downs, potions with Yuna. I'm gonna revive and heal everybody. A potion and a high potion gets the job done. Don't kill Riku again, come on. All right, good stuff. Let's just get everyone up on our feet here. Hmm. If that goes here, oh! Then... Maybe I should combine two Phoenix Downs. What would that do? Oh, well, this was that was a waste. Let's ensure. I, I would like to have... Uh, I'd like to have three people. This is not good here. I don't want to die here. I need a Mega Phoenix... Uh... Don't have any Mega Phoenixes. Um, little concerned. I'm a little concerned here. <laughs> ah, I'm not having, not joking around anymore, am I? Okay. Come on now. Come on, Yuna. 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 <sighs> Man. And yeah, I'm still going to use, uh... I'm just going to continue to heal myself here. Oh, I wish Riku used that on Yuna instead. Don't, don't do that. Oh, come on. Man, this guy's annoying. I guess I was not expecting this battle to be so crazy and intense, man. Okay, if I can just get everyone on my feet. If I can just get everyone on my feet. Riku, use a X potion on Yuna. Just need to get everyone on my feet, for God's sakes. Game's getting crazy. I am gonna stop using the darkness spell. I don't need to uh, be hurting my chances here. There goes pain. This guy's fast, man. You should probably really get ready for this battle. Slowing this de slowing this thing down would be a good idea for starters. Tough dude. But if we're gonna get to our final chapter, we gotta deal with this guy, man. I'm not too busy to have a quick sip of my coffee. 
Oh boy, or am I? Glad I got that sip and it was an important sip. It was a must sip, everybody. Should I switch Riku to Black Mage? Ah, I feel like I should just continue with what I'm doing here. Yeah, you might want to go with a certain configuration, but uh... Uh-oh. But I think I'm finally on my feet here. I'm finally on my feet. He's damaging me still some pretty well, but... I'm glad I uh, had that available for Yuna to switch to Alchemist. Because that is a... Uh, that's a must. How much HP does this bra have? Ouch! I only have two attackers. But you need someone healing you non-stop. I mean, come on, look at this. If only I could really inflict darkness on him. I don't have uh, many moves. Can we try bio on this thing? Maybe we should. Let's try and do something here. We gotta do something, everybody. Hmm. <laughs> I wish. I doubt I can confuse him, of course, he never can. You can never do that stuff on the important battles. This is gonna hurt you, Yuna. Oh, he didn't get me. Oh, there, no, there it is. Of course. Ow. Ow, this is a bad thing here. I couldn't inflict them with bio, of course. Oh, thank you. hoo Good job, Pain. That's what I'm talking about. Well, wasn't that fun? That was spicy. That was very spicy. I got a lot of red pepper out of that. A little red pepper spice out of that battle. Oof, red pepper spice battles. Those are the best. Ah, a chest. Okay, I got that. Now, you know, game, take me out of here. I don't want to walk out. I don't want to walk out of here with more random battles. Watch me get killed. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Just look at the map. It's like playing Blitzball. Oh, God. My eyes. They couldn't roll anymore, man. They're... It's like double time rolls. Double time eye rolls. Just like... Oh, just get me out of this hell. That's navigating... Ooh. Navigating through this. Like, you really have to look at the map because the angles, the camera angles, get all like. They do it on purpose. Hello, everybody! How are you? I'm gonna run away. Well, I defeated the, the lizard. He was annoying. I'm a hero! Oh, yeah, and Sin, too. Remember him? Yeah. You, no, you don't? Now let's go, oh dear. Oh, what's up with this guy? Let's go kill the high pillow. I wouldn't imagine the high pillow would taste good. Probably be like eating frogs. Yeah, totally. Cook up fast. Not a lot of meat in them bones. Yeah, like frog legs, man. Tastes like chicken. Good stuff. How y'all doing today? Are you ready for a concert? Because I'm ready to give it to you. We're landing. If we cram any more people on board, this thing is gonna fall out of the sky. Oh, I'm back on the airship. I forgot. I bet I'm denied from going anywhere else. Stop me now. Oh. This is not a good time for you to go outside. We are staying put until the chief is here. Pfft. Yeah, I bought a... I bought a do whatever the hell I want. Well, I, I can't go up top, huh? 
Ah, uh, I stayed in the cabin in Chapter 4. Of course, I must have. Uh, wow, that took like, took a while. Uh, I might stay in the cabin in Chapter 4 again, just because I want to be careful here. Why is there, get that, get out of my face, other chocobo. It's almost time, Lady Yuna. I think I'm more nervous than you. Miss Yuna, what can I do for you? Offer me your legs. Sleep tight. Offer me your legs. I'm hungry! Well, now we're safe. Oh, look, isn't that cool? You can see the rain on the windows outside. That's a nice little touch. I like nice little touches. Hmm, that doesn't sound right. <laughs> ho ho ho! That doesn't sound right, everybody! Uh, okay then. I'm gonna go to the bridge. Giddy up. Nice little touches. Alright, he's having a problem. Hey, we brought in people from the Yevon and the Youth League. They're all outside on the concert grounds. Yuna, now it is all up to you. Spira is going to be killed softly by your song. Yeah, keep moving like that. Hey, uh, the crowd is acting kind of funny. Let me pull the video up. Uh-oh, this could get messy. No kidding. The two groups have been bumping heads since they got on the airship. Yeah. Looks like they're itching to start something. I'll pick up the audio. The Yevonites are here too? How am I supposed to enjoy the concert with them stinking up the air? Hey! You youth league dogs will never be worthy of hearing the high summoner sing. If the Praetor were here, he'd never let these maggots walk around spouting their nonsense. What I want to know is, where'd Nuge go? It's his fault that Spear is falling apart. What kind of leader abandons his people when they need him most? Don't they ever stop? Seriously? Well, Yuna, you're the one who wanted to do something. Yeah, but... Right? <laughs> so let's do something. Right! Let's do it! Oh, catastrophic catastrophe! Dear me, dear me! What or whatever should I do? The spectators are making the spectacle! I don't even want to speculate! Please, do something, Yuna! Leave it to us! Ah, okay. Man, this concert's still not beginning. Who do I talk to to initiate this thing? I don't know. I hope it doesn't get violent out there. Well, let's just pray your song is enough to stop the fighting. Then I can go back to the Mount Gagas at Hot Springs and get a rub down by uh, High Pello. All right. So... Spira is going to be killed softly by your song. Yuna, we're counting on you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yuna, we're counting on you. Uh -huh. Ooh, ooh. Do I get to sing back up? Just get out there and start singing. The rest will come naturally. 
Yeah, you mean like it'll all come unnaturally? Like I put on that dress sphere and let that thing do the work for me or Yeah, whatever. So we're here folks, it's the Thunder Plains. Everything's looking good. And uh alright, yeah, let's put on this concert. Fiona, we're counting on you! Actually, hold on. I'm gonna talk to Shinra, let's see what he's up to. Oh, I see. Thanks, Pain. Sing like you always do. It's hard to talk to him here. My sphere screen is gonna knock Spear's pants off. <laughs> Nervous or not, I'm really pumped to do this. Fiona, we're counting on you. All right, fine. One thousand years ago, before the time of sin, Spira was torn in two, divided by a terrible war. This was Spira's great mistake. Out of the rift left by this terrible conflict, sin was born. In only two short years, Spira has shaken off its unhappy past. We have moved on. Now, Spira grows brighter with each passing day. That light is our strength. I don't want to see it fade. Do you? There are so many of us, each with different ideas and different beliefs. Of course we sometimes disagree, and arguments will happen. But our hearts can and should always be one. Believe with me. Even if we are torn apart, our feelings will unite us. That is what this song is about.
You know. I'm all right. I'm fine, really. It's past now. What did Shinra say? Um, he said it might be some kind of uh, interference with the sphere waves. Yuni's dress sphere and the sphere screen reacted with each other, and uh, the consciousness burned into the dress sphere was projected onto the screen, <laughs> or something like that. Okay, but that doesn't explain why it happened. When I asked, he said, I'm only a kid. Ugh. It's Len. I was singing her feelings. During the song, I could feel them welling up inside until they just burst. So the people we saw were Len and Shuyin? Everyone's waiting. Let's go. All right, so that just happened, and then the explanation happened. We'll talk about the explanation first. Uh, okay. Makes sense, or it doesn't, or does it even matter? Uh, basically, we just kind of witnessed a powerful cinematic. Uh, we kind of got a little backstory on Shu Yin and Len and what happened. And I mean, we saw bits and pieces about it all before, but that kind of just clarified things, basically. You know what I mean? So, uh, there you go. Definitely one of the uh, more powerful scenes of the game, as a lot of people would say or and agree. So there you go, folks. We're going to kick off Chapter 5 in a matter of moments. Or has it started already? Eh, either way, before we get to anything else, I'm going to call it a wrap right here. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Quit some of those comments and tell me about what you think in regarding to this part. You know, you know the, uh, the concert or before the concert. There you go. Uh, like always, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter. The links are in the description. I'm Dave the Usher for the Game Replay. Stay tuned for the next part of Final Fantasy X-2 HD Remaster. I'll see you guys next time. I am out.